Hi uh, everybody, it's Faith from Firesign Tarot. I hope everybody's well. Knocking them out for August. Come hell or high water. And I can't swim, so let's get this done. Capricorn, you are up. No, really, I can't swim. I'm actually terrified of the water, which is really terrible growing up in northern Michigan because I'm never, and I mean literally never more than like 20 minutes from somewhere to swim. So being terrified of the water is actually kind of a bitch. Six of Pentacles tried to come out. Could have something to do with equal give and take and a connection. We'll see if it comes back out. All right. This reading is for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. If it resonates with you, cool. It's your free will to do whatever you choose to do with the message given by the cards. If you choose to do anything else, it's your journey, not mine. I'm just throwing down cards. If it doesn't resonate, that's okay, too. You can check your Moon, Rising, or Venus sign readings if you think you might want something that might resonate a little bit better. Just keep in mind, time and energy are both fluid, and all things can and maybe vice versa. Might even play it from the perspective of a cross-watcher. And our dear friends, the cross-watchers are always welcome here at the Fire Sign Tarot table. Everybody's always welcome at my table, and I appreciate you coming by to hang out with little old me. How wonderful of you. All right. While you're here, if you feel so inclined... You can hit the uh, subscribe button and the notification bell. That would be pretty sweet. That way you know when I upload. Because, you know, depending on, you know, my pain level and stuff like that, sometimes they're kind of few and far between. So, you know, I, I try to keep it as often as humanly possible for me. But, you know, if you hit the like button, that'd be pretty cool too. It all helps the channel out. It is greatly appreciated. All right, before I do the invocation and throw your cards down, Capricorn, there's a couple things we got to go over. One, never make a life-altering decision based on a tarot reading. You have your free will, and I ask that you use it wisely and to the best of your human ability. So, in other words, if making the wrong decision is going to completely jack up your universe, I highly suggest that you just go inside and make that decision for yourself, and not necessarily rely on tarot cards to make that decision for you. Two, if... It's not your reading, not your story, not your message. If it's not vibing with you, if it's not resonating in your life in any way, shape, or form, leave the cards on the table and walk away. It's not your message. It's not always going to be your message. This is a general reading. I'm pulling a lot of stuff out of the universe right now. So if it's not resonating with you, it's not your story. It's fine. Take with you what might resonate if you so choose. Leave what does not. Don't make it fit if it's not fitting. All right. Heavenly Father, Mother, with Holy Spirit, Spirit Guides, and Archangels, I ask for any messages you have for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, August 2021. Thanks for coming down and hanging out with me again tonight. I appreciate you. I am grateful and thankful for this gift that I've been given, and I ask that you help me use that gift to clearly and accurately convey the messages to Capricorn to bring them to their highest possible spiritual good and put them on their highest possible spiritual path. Capricorn, why are you here? Ten of Swords reversed. You're fighting and ending. You're fighting a painful ending right now. You realize the sun's going to shine again, right? It's only going to suck for a minute. It's only going to suck for a minute. Just throwing that out there. The longer you fight it, the worst it sucks. It happened in the past. Wheel of Fortune. Justice reversed. Yeah. I'm getting a feeling. Yeah, in the moment, it kind of felt like it wasn't fair. Three off balance a little bit. But this is something that had to come to an end. It was supposed to. Here and now, Six of Cups, Soulmate. Soulmate connection. Possibly past life. Karmic. It's supposed to end. I know you don't want it to. You think, you think the world of the person you're dealing with. You don't want it to. It's supposed to. Three of Swords. Ace of Pentacles. It's only going to suck for a minute. Three of Swords. Ace of Pentacles. This, this is, yeah. 
whatever this is, is leading you to something better. That's abundance, baby. Abundance. All right, we're leaving it. We're leaving it. Let's catch the energy of the person you're dealing with. Universe, source, spirit, and guides. Can I get the energy of the person that Capricorn is dealing with? Situation for August One more. It's telling me one more. Okay. Four of Cups reversed. Queen of Swords. Judgment reversed. Seven of, Pentacles, Seven of Cups reversed. Eight of Pentacles reversed. Sun reversed. Guess what? Queen of Swords, acknowledgement of the truth. They don't want this any more than you do. They really don't. No. Nothing. I'm reading. Sorry. <laughs> I got distracted. I'm like a squirrel. Sometimes I hear something or I see something. <laughs> it's like, wait, what, what the heck's going on? Okay. They're not any happier about this than you are by the looks of things. They're really not. Ten of Swords reversed your fight in the ending. Four of Cups reversed. They're straight up ignoring how this feels. Seven of Cups reversed. Confused feelings. Second guessing a judgment. Judgment reversed. But that Queen of Swords with that wheel, I mean, there's no argument. Truth was spoken. Acknowledgement of truth. Honest conversations went down. All right, let's get it. Let's get some clarity. Let's get some clarity for Capricorn. Here we store spirit and guys. Can I get some clarity in the cards and the table for Capricorn? August 2021, please. Capricorn, August 2021. Clarity for Capricorn is the person they're dealing with. Person, situation, and whatever. It's usually a person. I don't know why I say situation. Typically, it's a person. It's like usually it ends up being a love reading. Every once in a while, it's like financials and jobs and life paths and crap, but ultimately, it's usually love. But r really, it, I mean, to be perfectly honest, I, I found a lot of times in my own personal life that love led me down paths I was supposed to go down career-wise, which is super weird. And you know who you are, and if you're watching, thank you. <laughs> they know who they are. Anyway. Okay. I, you know, it's been working out the last couple of readings. I'm gonna, re I'm gonna clarify the past first. Let me clarify the past first. What's with this wheel of fortune? What's with this wheel of fortune for Capricorn? Hi. <laughs> All right, it bounced off the deck. It was in reverse. Ten of Swords reversed. Something that had to come to an end, and you fought it when it happened, and you're still fighting it. The sun's never going to shine again. This sucks. Yeah, it sucks right now. Uh, judging by the conclusion of this, it's not going to suck forever. So, not going to suck forever. Not, I'm not even going to throw another one down on that. Why is justice reversed here?
Eight of Cups reversed, King of Wands reversed. You're okay. This this imbalance and the and your feelings about this being unfair and unjust is keeping you stuck. King of Wands reversed, Eight of Cups reversed. You keep revisiting this. You're stuck. You're not moving forward. You keep going back emotionally, mentally. One more. Hi. Ace of Wands reversed. You can't start anything new. This is sucking the life out of you, Capricorn. Why are you allowing this to happen? And I don't mean to yell at you. I'm trying not to have a mom moment. But, you know, every once in a while, Big Mom Sag has a mom moment. Why is the king? Why, sorry. Why is the queen of swords here for the person that Capricorn is dealing with? Why the queen of swords? Why the queen of swords? Why the queen of swords? Hi. Eight of wands reversed. Yeah. Speed or messages? One more. Something to do with the speed at which things was moving. Eight of Wands reversed. Truth spoken. Speed at which things were moving. Ace of Pentacles. Somebody wanted to move slow. Things were moving too fast for somebody. They wanted to slow it down. Truths were spoken. One more. Oh. High Priestess reversed fell out. One more. Hermit reversed. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, somebody went into isolation mode. Somebody may have just needed time. Somebody may have just needed space. Some of you may have been ignoring their intuition a little bit. This isn't screaming like ego to me. Things were moving way too quick. They wanted to slow it down. I think they isolated themselves from you. Isolated themselves from the connection. I think that's what you thought was unfair and unjust. Was the speed at which things were moving. Why is judgment reversed here for the past? Not so distant past for the person Capricorn's dealing with. My judgment reversed. Thank you, hanged man. Reversed. Oh. Mm. Well, that's second guess in a judgment call. One more. One more. Stun reverse. They're not happy about it either. I think maybe they're not happy about your reaction. One more. Five of Wands reverse. They they're like, I don't wanna I don't wanna fight with you. This is like avoidance of conflict because I think this may have gotten a little bit, uh, I don't know, heated, maybe, possibly. One more, one more, one more, one more. They didn't want this becoming conflict. Seven of Swords is, you know, truth spoken. Truth spoken. They, they wanted to be honest. They were honest about how they felt, and I think you just, I don't know. I'm not, the cards aren't saying that, like, that you went all bonkers, but I'm, I'm getting this, like, vibe that, you know, put yourself, flip, whatever the situation, you know, I know what I'm trying to say. I can't make the words work. My throat chakra is not letting the words come out. Put yourself where you see fit. Flip the rolls around if you see so fit. Somebody wanted to avoid conflict because they thought things were moving a little bit too quickly. And somebody just went all bat crap bonkers about how unfair it was. And they're still stuck about it. Okay. 
And all things being fair and equal, I'm going to throw one on the past. I need a mutual. Can I get a mutual? Can I get a mutual? Just one. Just one mutual. Emperor reverse shit may have gotten a little out of control. <laughs> Think feelings got a little out of control. Things just got a little bit out of control. Okay. Okay. All right. Moving on. Fast forward. Current energy. Okay. I'm done beating that dead horse. Why is the Ten of Swords still here for Capricorn? Why are they still all Ten of Swords reversed? Page of Wands reversed. It's it's like you don't want to move forward. Here, still stuck. One more. Oh, oh God. Okay. Wheel of Fortune in the upright. Wheel of Fortune in the upright again. Capricorn. It happened for you too. It's done. It's still done. Was then, is now. You're still fighting it. You're fighting an ending. Because you're stuck. You don't want to move forward. Knight of Cups. Because you still very much hold a cup for this person. And that's okay. It's okay to still have those feelings. But they don't want to see the cup right now. You can hold that cup out until your arm falls off. I, they don't want to see it. They're not going to see it. Why is the four of cups reversed here? Five of Cups reversed. King of Swords reversed. They're coming out of their sadness about it. They're not... If they were sad, they're coming out of it. I don't think they're sad about it at all. I think it was very matter of fact. Possibly got a little bit unnecessarily wordy. Words probably cut, or they're gonna cut. And go off into this conflict that they've been trying to avoid if things get any more out of control. Ten of Cups reversed. They're not happy. They're not happy. They're not seeing any any hope of happiness with you. They're not seeing it. And I, I hate to be that reader. I read what I see. I don't want to be that person, but to cups reversed. It's if they got anything to say, it ain't gonna be messages of love. I tell you that right now. All right. Why is the six of cups here? For Capricorn. Kicking it a long time. Possible soulmate connection. Maybe past life. Eight of Pentacles reversed. This may be affecting your work. Maybe you can't concentrate on work. Or you're no longer putting energy into it currently. Or you feel like there's you have nothing left to give because you've given everything. Knight of Swords reversed. There's no communication either way. Or you've been blocked. Or you did some blocking. Maybe you finally blocked them. I think they may have blocked you. Take it take it however it is. Put yourself where you see fit. Eight of Swords reversed. Trying not to think about it, but you're still consumed by it. I don't think you're as consumed as you were, but you still very much hold a cup for him. And you still haven't moved on. Why is the seven of cups reversed here for the person that you're dealing with?
two of cups reversed. Six of pentacles. They've given all they're going to give. This is energy match. Energy match. They're trying to be as fair as possible. This is not a path they want to go down. You may see it as unfair. They don't. Six of Swords reversed. I flipped it with my toe. The world upright. It was in the upright when it landed. They're they're done. They're done. And I don't want to be cruel, but they're done. They may have returned to an old connection that was more fair and equal, or where they could be more fair and equal. I don't think they're confused by this at all. This is a path they don't want to go down. They want nothing to do with the path. They want nothing to do with the cup. Things got, things were out of control. It moved too quickly. I'm not a finger pointer. Take it out if it resonates. Flip it if you have to. Things got out of control. It's done. It was karmic. The universe is saying that this is done. Why is the three of swords here? Has three swords here for Capricorn in the future. Death reversed. It's fighting change. Fighting the death cycle. Fighting the ending. Capricorn, why you gotta keep fighting this? One more. Four cups reversed. You're fighting it because they don't want your cup. <laughs> You're fighting it because you may end up ignoring what the universe is trying to hand you, which is a new start in abundance. Something better for you. You're going to miss it if you don't let this go. If you don't let the death happen. If you don't let the ending happen, you're going to miss it, Capricorn. One on the Ace of Pentacles, please. Gave me three. Four of Swords reversed. Three of Cups reversed. Tower reversed. Hear me out. Hear me out. Okay, the tower reversed and the ace of pentacles is, is the potential to rebuild, you know, the tower that fell where you want it and have it be abundant. I need clarity on this four swords reversed and this three cups reversed, though. One card, please. Nine of wands, throw in the towel. Throw in the towel. Eventually, I see you throwing in the towel and letting go of the disconnect and letting go of all the rest of this energy and building that big beautiful tower in the land of abundance once you finally let go and release and allow the ending in the death cycle to occur. Eight of Pentacles reversed for them. They ain't putting energy into this. They're not. They let this go long before you ever did. Temperance reversed. Queen of Pentacles reversed. Interesting. They're not putting energy into it because they weren't meant for you. There's negative energy between you. Temperance reversed. Queen of Pentacles reversed. It's not your fish. Capricorn, they're not your fish. Let's 
strength reversed, this entire connection is just extremely draining for them. They're drained. Why is the stone reversed here? Three of Wands. Five of Swords reversed. That's ironic. It's ironic. Here's the weird part. I kind of feel like they're going to be full of regret at the end of the day when once they see how wonderful and abundant your life becomes once you finally let this go. That doesn't mean don't let it go. It means you should definitely let it go. Absolutely let it go. Because there's something more for you. Go back to the past and when I said earlier things move too quickly maybe it wasn't time yet maybe it wasn't time yet all things in time all things in time if something is meant for you and it, you have it and then it leaves you if it is meant for you it will return that doesn't mean you sit on your hands and wait for it to return. That means you move on with your life. Capiche? Alright, let's get your advice and then I gotta take the kid to work. Okay. I'm going to Five minutes. I'm recording. Okay. Queen of Wands reversed. Five of Wands reversed. Shadow side reversed. You need to just... Okay, this has become toxic. The energies here, have, you've hung on to this for so long and so tight that it has literally become toxic. You need to release it. You need to not be so combative about it. And fight it so hard that you never release this burden. Because you need to start on a new path. That's a path to abundance. A path to abundance that you don't get if you stay hung up on it. Okay? Oh my gosh, two fools. Two fools reverse. One upright, one upside down. If you fight this new start, you don't get your new start. You need to put it out of your head. It gets weirder. Hold on. If you fail to move forward to an equal connection, and you fail to see the truth about this death cycle, energy's never even out, and you never get what you really want. Reunion. So you need to lay this to rest and stop fighting the truth and accept it don't close yourself off to the emotions that go along with this and never process it because you don't get your new start you don't get the good thing that's coming to you if you keep fighting this Capricorn I love you you know I do and I don't like having these mom moments. I read what I read, I see what I see. And what I see is you fighting something that is necessary. Sometimes things come into your life to steer you down the path that you are supposed to go down. And if you fight letting them go, really cheating yourself out of the abundance and wonderfulness along the path you're supposed to go down. Don't stay stuck. I'm checking out. Know that you loved. Be blessed. Take care. We'll catch you next time.